Hello, this is a quick little tutorial here for galvanizing your first steel. Uh, galvanized steel is used for all of the uh, level one non heat accepting machines. So you're looking at electrolyzers and canning machines things like that that don't accept heat. So all of your LV or um, tier one machines will need uh, galvanized steel. And this is how you will make your galvanized uh, steel casing. Uh, you have different options. You can galvanize each item individually and put it together or you can galvanize the casing as a whole. So, first thing you're going to need is a bathing pot. You need to make sure you have the stainless steel bathing pot. It doesn't matter if it is the partial one here or the full uh, I'm using the partial one. So five stainless steel will be what you need to get this done. And this is a non-automatic way. You'll need zinc dust, which you'll throw in your crucible. Uh, ceramic crucible is just fine for this. Zinc melts very low. Burning box of any type that you would like to use, whether it be uh, solid, liquid, or gas. Any one of these three will work. If you're using solid, though, use something that will be able to be turned off rather quickly because zinc has a 600-ish melting point, so it does not need to be uh, heated up for very long. And I threw two of them in here. So there we go. It is now melted. And use a faucet on the side of your crucible. And if you right click that, that will dump it into the bathing pot below. Bathing pots have no uh, gooey to them. And you don't have to worry about getting burnt. You can see I have no d buffs. And I have no suit on while I'm doing this. And I'm going to put all six of these in here. And then I'll put these two in. And there are the parts to make a galvanized steel casing. Now, the way I typically will do this is as a full casing rather than doing it this way which I think I turned these around again. There we go. And there's your casing. Now, there is a way to automate this. That is using this setup here, which will require a smelter, so you'll have to get tungsten and be able to process tungsten to do it. But use a burning box under a smelter, and a reg regular bath. And then you will just smelt your zinc in here. It'll come into here. Put your parts, whatever it is that you're wanting, they, uh, into the bath itself. And then it will, over time, do it. Bath takes no power whatsoever. And then... You can also use a laser welder to make your machine casings. You put in two long rods and six plates. It will automate making the casings itself. If it's set up properly. So there is your galvanized machine casing and how you will make it. 
remember with any of your galvanized rods, galvanized steel is a special case. It cannot be cut and manipulated after it has been galvanized. So as a note, make sure that if it needs to be further processed, that you process it before galvanizing it. Galvanizing it should be your last step before assembly. Hopefully that helps any of y'all. If you have any questions, feel free to ask. I'll see you later.